computers working. See, it drops into this scallop belt. Pretty cool. So the auger senses if it's got a load, and then uh, if there's no load on the auger, then it starts moving down and goes and seeks the load. And it's got these little limit switches here that kill it when it's loading up too much, and then it then it stops and just augers in. Here's the gear motor and drives the auger. Here's, this is the feed motor, the feed drive to move the chain. And you've got these little limit switches up here. This tells the tilt of it. So this one must be when you get to the end of the travel. See that that one, that one right here. So when you, if I touch that thing, it would stop, and it would think it would going or the other side going the wrong way. <laughs> and then there's the cabling. Just the little links to, to uh, keep track of the cable and the power. That's great, right? Here's the here's the end of the line. This is the uh, the end of the conveyor belt. So let, you can see right there the bid is low. You can see the window. See the window, it's low, it's calling for it. So So this thing will start filling up, filling up the bid. So off he goes. You'll get more on that than you use the bit. I mean it's a 